I'm not going to do a long introduction. I'm going to be so brief to the point. Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, my name is Divan Sogueno and this is Divan Empire. Hoping you're doing well from right where you're watching us from because this is that channel that gives you the best of all types of content. If you want recipes, you'll find them here. If you want adventurous videos that involve traveling, you'll find them here. If you want review videos where we review celebrities, we review different artists, you'll find them here. If you want lifestyle videos, where we show you how to survive life in different angles whether rich or poor you'll find them here today's video we are going to do a video that involves a lot of cooking and packaging of food and why are we doing this kind of video it's because number one to those of you who don't know i'm still single i'm not yet married and uh, because of that cooking is a challenge to me Many single people will confirm to you that cooking is difficult, very difficult, especially cooking food for only one person. Can you imagine a situation where you stay alone and then you have to cook lunch, you have to cook breakfast, you have to cook dinner, you have to cook supper, all those meals. Imagine, and you're just one person. Number one, it's tiresome. It's time consuming. It's, uh, it, 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 it makes all utensils dirty. And... Uh, you get discouraged most of the time so you find in most cases you rarely cook you rarely even want to make your tenses dirty and that is me now i was defining myself today i want to cook different meals and then i'm going to pack them together sorry uh. i was picking this small pin it can prick me if i'm not aware I'm going to cook different types of meals and then I'm going to pack them in containers for a whole week. So the food that I'm going to cook today is going to be too much because it's for it's supposed to take me for a whole week. Don't ask yourself questions. I stay alone. If a visitor comes, we'll figure out that at that particular time. But for now, because I'm alone, I'm going to cook for myself and then I will pack them into seven containers for seven days. Uh, you understand and then we'll store them in our freezer thank god for the provision of a fridge so once they're stored in the freezer they won't go bad they will stay for a long time anytime i'm hungry i will just take out a meal and then i will warm it and that is what i will eat for that particular day so the foods can be for either lunch or supper or just supper alone or maybe lunch alone yeah uh, for it's all about calculations and planning. Without wasting much time, let's just start this video by cooking. We want to cook different types of foods that I may not show you the procedures. So first of all, it's very important to show you what I'm going to work with here. These are my uh, ingredients. Those are the things I will use. I will also use spices. Of course, spices is a must. Me, I'm not going to cook food that is tasteless. No, I'm going to cook food that I'm going to enjoy. So, uh, I work hard because of my stomach. I'm just getting spices up here. I work so hard, extremely hard, because of my stomach. Okay, so these are the spices we are going to use. Yeah, these are the common ones that I normally use. I use garlic. Uh, I also use mixed spices. I use this curry powder. I also use paprika and also black pepper. Those are the spices, the main ones that I usually use, as well as roiko cubes. You see, those are roiko cubes. Yes. Then I have here my garlic. Uh, I have my uh, onions here. I have, um, how do we call these ones? Green pepper or pili pili ho ho. Tomatoes are here. I have my leafy onions. I have my beans here. For foodstuffs, I have beans. I have sukumawiki and kels here. I have mboga ya kienyeji here. This one is a mixture of different uh, vegetables, traditional vegetables. I have my jar of water here because I have to cook some foods with water. I have my green, uh, you know, vegetables here. I don't know how to call them. French beans, carrots, as well as peas. I think this is too much, but I'm not sure. I've never cooked this before. This is my first time. I have potatoes here for stew. And then I have my 
my rice here rice is going to be the main meal here um uh, what else do we have i have some beef here i have beef of course and also some eggs here those ones i will show you while i'm packing the foods and also some piece of ugali here ugali is something i prefer when it's cooked hot and fresh okay uh, i was forgetting these ones these ones are uh, this is the way we uh, we stone in uh this philip how do we call them coriander so i'm going to use uh, how many stews do we have here? One, two, three. Three stews. Let me just take out two. No, three. I will use the three. Okay. That's too much anyway. They're just for taste. beautiful people finally food is ready and this is what we have cooked we have potatoes we have bean stew we have rice as the main food here we have a collection or a mixture of peas and vegetables french vegetables carrots and what and what we have here our traditional vegetables as well as our sukuma wiki and spinach mixed so we are just going to serve the foods are still hot they have to cool so that is why we serve early don't mind why i'm eating too much rice it's not that i'm going to eat it all the time but if i eat it for one meal the other meal i will alternate maybe with ugali of course this doesn't mean that i will not be cooking i will still have to cook well need be but for now i have enough food food stock so when i'm hungry i just take out food from the freezer and just warm okay so you can see those are my containers how many are they one two three four five six seven eight those are for eight different days Actually, they can be for nine days. So we just start serving.
so guys this is the way they uh, have packed them so this is a complete meal uh it's well balanced the diet is well balanced so i will just wait for them to cool here and then i cover them actually how many have come out one two three four five six so we have for six days these ones are for six days we still have extra food here we have sukuma wiki here we have mboga kenyeji these ones we are just going to store them on the normal fridge we will cook them with ugali i'll prefer to eat this with ugali this with ugali so that rice cannot grow in our stomachs so this is one way that is very conservative for me and works well for me because of time so guys these are the food cooling down waiting to be preserved yeah so all that food that you saw me cook are fitted into these tins so as soon as they are cold they are cool we will just store them for future use the excess ones are these ones these other ones on this side are extra ones these ones are to take me for each meal yeah So guys, <laughs> that's the final product. That space there is for this other uh, food that we have here. It's still hot. Let it cool, give it time. So I have enough food. This is the freezer section of my fridge. So these ones will turn into solid ice, very hard. These ones are foods that can be reused every day. Like I'll use them for, if I eat one meal from up here, the, the next meal will come from down here. So I will balance. Mostly the foods that are down here are supposed to be eaten with ugali. I love fresh ugali. And that is the reason why I have uh, placed them down here. So for now, that one is just okay if it's closed that way. And then this other food, let it just give it time. Apparently that was it for our video today. I hope you've enjoyed this video from the start to the end. I hope you've been entertained. I hope you've also learned something. If you are a bachelor, if you find it difficult to cook, sometimes just cook uh, food in bulk and store and just take them out. I have a microwave behind me here. It is supposed to help me warm the foods. And sometimes also it's just important to take the foods quite early enough when you wake up in the morning just remove the food from the freezer and let it defrost with the time as the day continues mostly these meals i'll be using them for lunch for supper i will prefer to cook fresh food again so that you don't say at your avoid eating food kept in the fridge and uh, food warmed by microwave you'll get cancer and what and what yeah once in a while we mess up but once in a while again we correct the mistake thank you so much for watching thank you so much for being here up to the end until next time always work hard and be nice to people and remember that nothing is impossible this is divan's empire end of discussion